Well, that's just amazing. Billy, the groundhog found its shadow. And that means Halloween's just around the corner, and you and I get to pretend to be things we're not for a few days. Just like role-playing on the internet. That's why my avatar is a happy person. Anyways, let's do some mods. The first mod we're going to be covering is a Friday the 13th mod by Doom Based. Now it puts a quest in your pit boy that you can just track, but as you can see it's kind of far away, so we have to fast travel there, but hopefully not too fast, because we still need to abide by traffic laws. Isn't that right, Billy? Safety first. What did I just say? <clears throat> so ignoring Speed Demon Billy, the first thing you'll notice at Crystal Lake is the shh 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 sound that plays as soon as you get here, which I think is kind of neat. It happens whenever Jason's near. Speaking of him, we've got to find him and kill him at- What is up with everyone in running today? Yo, I'm not going anywhere. Why do you have to run? See, this, this is what happens when you run. You run at someone carrying a machete and there's still- They throw copious amounts of grenades at you. Come on, get up. Yo, I'm not buying it. I've seen the movies. You've died like 14 times. Yeah, go ahead and pretend to be dead. Next thing you'll know, you'll be in space and half machine. That was a dumb movie. Now, once you kill Jason, you'll be able to lose his clothes, his mask, and a relatively powerful one-handed machete. And I have to say, they are quite snazzy murdering clothes. Or trick-or-treating clothes. But let's be fair, if you're wearing a mask, you're probably murdering people. And I mean, that's fine. I'm not gonna judge you. I'm not gonna pay for stem packs either. It's all about the murder. I wonder who's making that sound now. Anyways, on to the next mod. Hey, Billy, is there chemistry between us? Or is it just... The chemistry station right there. Okay. Next mod up is Torch and Lantern by M150 and allows you to make wearable lanterns, torches, well, you can carry the torch, but jack o' lanterns and lanterns that you can attach to your waist. Now, in order to make them, you have to go to a chemistry station and get the materials. But probably the most interesting thing about this mod is they actually toggle on and off like the flashlight or like your pit boy if you use it for a light. So, currently for me, it's the tab key. It works for the jack-o'-lantern and the lantern. That and the torch looks absolutely mental when you swing it. Just look at it. You are wielding fire. Well, that's about all the constructive commentary I can give on this mod. It's great for survival roleplay, or if you just want something Halloween themed, you can tie a pumpkin to your waist and wander around. I'm gonna keep it installed just so I can swing a fiery stick at people, but it's time to stop because there's a stop sign. And for the most aptly named mod, we have to go back to the chemistry station for a Halloween mod by Eleonora. Now, the applications of this mod alone is immense. For example, you can have a Hannibal Lecter mask in case you want to make Mix kill himself. That's very important. You can have a Halloween pumpkin head in case you needed, you know, to be the Pumpkin King. Or go kidnap Santa Claus. Or you can be a boss-ass witch. Which I am. I'm a boss-ass witch. 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 I have to be actually be honest for once, it's actually beautiful the fact that this works on males and females. Normally when I put on like a dress mod or some form of female body mod, it twists my guy's character into something awful looking or just crashes my game. I love the fact that this can be put on my dude. It's, just, it's actually... I'm, I'm gonna keep this installed forever. I love it. I, I love everything about it. Anyways, I have to go take Billy Trick or Treating because I accidentally killed his parents again. <laughs> my bad. Anyways, make sure you download and endorse all the mods you do like, because I'm sure mod authors appreciate that, and a lot of this takes a lot of work. And they are beautiful people. Hey, let's be- I am a witch right now. Mwah. It's beautiful. I love it. Alright, have a good day. Oh, what's that right there, Billy? Look, I got you some candy. Is this not the candy you wanted? I mean, yeah, it's a bag of blood, but I mean... Okay. Look, Slugger, I'm sorry I couldn't find you any candy. Oh. Hey, Billy, you know what's almost as sweet as candy? A baby's giggle. Hey, baby, I'm gonna need you to giggle, baby. I don't think it hurt me. That was one sound sleeper. Hey, baby, can you, can you wake up? You know, when I was that young, I didn't sleep that soundly. Like the fire alarm or a thunderstorm woke me right up. Kids nowadays. What the hell am I doing on this bridge? 